The General Electric T700 and CT7 are a family of turboshaft and turboprop engines in the 1500 to 3000 shp, 1100 to 2200 kilowatts class. Topic design and development In 1967, General Electric began work on a new turboshaft engine demonstrator designated the GE-12 in response to U.S. Army interest in a next-generation utility helicopter. The GE-12 was designed and conceived by GE's Art Adamson and Art Adenolfi. In 1967, both GE and Pratt and & Whitney were awarded contracts to work parallel with each other to design, fabricate, and test the technology. The Army effort led, in the 1970s, to development of the Sikorsky S-70 Black Hawk, powered by twin GE T-700 turboshafts, the production descendant of the GE-12. The T-700 was initially bench-tested in 1973, passed military qualification in 1976, and went into production in 1978. The initial T700 GE700 is an ungeared free turbine turboshaft, with a five stage axial, one stage centrifugal mixed flow compressor, featuring one piece blisk axial stages, with the inlet guide vanes and first two stator stages variable, an annular combustion chamber with central fuel injection to improve combustion and reduce smoke, a two stage compressor turbine, and a two stage free power turbine with tip shrouded blades. The engine is designed for high reliability, featuring an inlet particle separator designed to spin out dirt, sand, and dust. The T700 GE700 is rated at 1,622 shp 1,210 kilowatts intermediate power. The T700 GE700 was followed by improved and uprated Army engine variants for the R60 Black Hawk and the R64 Apache helicopters, as well as marinized naval engine variants for the SH60 Seahawk derivative of the Black Hawk, the SH2 G Seaswright, and the Bell AH1W Supercobra. T700s are also used on Italian and commercial variants of the Augusta Westland EH-101, AW-101 helicopter, and Italian variants of the Nindustries NH-90 helicopter. These are all twin-engine machines, except for the three-engined EH-101. The commercial version of the T700 is the CT7, with the engine used on the Bell 214ST, an enlarged version of the Huey, commercial Black Hawks, and the Sikorsky S92 derivative of the Black Hawk, all of which are twin-engine helicopters. The CT7 turboprop variants use the same core as the turboshaft variants, with a propeller gearbox fitted forward of the core. CT7 turboprops are used on variants of the Swedish Saab 340 airliner, the Indonesian Spanish Airtex CN235 cargo lifter, and the Czech Let L610G airliner, all twin turboprop aircraft. The baseline CT75A provides 1,735 shp 1,294 kilowatts on takeoff. In the late 1980s, GE also proposed a much larger turboprop, the T407, GLC38, with a five-stage axial, one-stage centrifugal mixed-flow compressor, an annular combustor with 15 burners, a two-stage compressor turbine, a three-stage power turbine, and max takeoff power of 6,000 shp 4, the YT-706 engine is based on the CT-78A engine. Compared with the H-60's primary T-700 engine, the T-706 has a larger compressor, hot section improvements, and full authority digital engine control. The T-706 is rated at 2,600 shp 1,939 kilowatts and increases the hot and high mission capability of the U.S. Army's MH-60M Black Hawk for special operations applications. Variants <inaudible> 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 T-700, military turboshaft engine YT-700, prototype version. T-700 GE-700, initial T-700 variant. 
T700 GE701, the improved T700 GE701A, 701B, 701C, 701 701D versions have also been developed from the original minus 700. T700 GE401, navalized version for SH-60 Seahawk helicopters. T700 GE401 C, universal application version of the minus 401. T700 GE701 C, universal application version of the minus 701. T700 TEI701 D, licensed produced version of TUSA's engine industries of Turkey. Developed for use in the Sikorsky, Turkish Aerospace Industries T-70 Utility Helicopter, CT-7 Turboshaft, commercial version of T-700. CT-72A, basic model CT-72D, higher flow compressor and surface coatings to improve resistance to wear and corrosion CT-7-2D1, similar to the CT-7-2D but uses a CT-7-6 type hot section CT-7-2E1 CT-7-6, 6A, the CT-7-6, 6A turboshaft engines are upgraded commercial variants of the successful T-700, CT-7 engine family. The turboshaft engine powers the entire development fleet of Augusta Westland AW101 helicopters with thousands of flight hours of operation. CT-7-8, the CT-7-8 is a family of powerful engines in the 2500-3000 SHP class. They are more powerful and more efficient versions of its predecessors. CT-78A, a version of the CT-7-8 family used to power older Sikorsky S-92, H-92 helicopters. CT-7-8A-1, a more fuel-efficient version of the CT-78A. It is used to power newer Sikorsky S-92, H-92 helicopters. The CT-7-8A-1 produces 2,520 shp. CT-7-8A-5 CT-7-8A-7, developed by GE as a more powerful, more efficient and more reliable version of the CT-7-8A-1 engine for the Royal Canadian Air Force's Sikorsky CH-148 Cyclone helicopters. It is the most modern version of the CT-7, T-700 engine family. The CT-7-8A-7 produces 3000 shp. CT-78B CT-7-8B-5 CT-78E CT-7-8E-5 CT-78F CT-7-8F-5 CT-7 turboprop, turboprop version of CT-7. CT-7-3, compact shortened and lightened version. CT-7-5A-2 CT-7-5A-3 CT-77A CT-7-7A-1 CT-79B CT-7-9B-1 CT-7-9B-2 CT-79C CT-7-9C-3 CT-79D CT-7-9D-2 Topic. Applications Topic. T-700, CT-7 turboshaft Augusta Westland AW101 Augusta Westland AW149 Augusta Westland AW189 Augusta Westland CH-149 Cormorant Bell 214ST Bell 525 Bell AH-1W Supercobra Bell AH-1Z Viper Bell UH-1Y Venom Boeing R-64 Apache Kaisurian Kaman SH-2G Super Seasrite Kamov Car 64 Sky Horse Lockheed Martin VH-71 Kestrel 
Mitsubishi H60, Nindustries NH90, Piasetsky X49, Sikorsky CH148 Cyclone, Sikorsky HH60 Jayhawk, Sikorsky HH60 Pave Hawk, Sikorsky SH60 Seahawk, Sikorsky R60 Black Hawk, Sikorsky S70, Sikorsky S92 Topic YT seven hundred and six turboshaft Sikorsky MH six OM Black Hawk Sikorsky S ninety seven Topic CT seven turboprop Casa IPTN CN two hundred and thirty five Let L six one OG Saab 340 Sukhoi Su-80 Topic Specifications T700 Topic General characteristics Type turboshaft Length 47 in 1200 mm T700 GE minus 700 and 700 first series 48 2 in 1220 mm T700 T6A Diameter 25 to 26 in 640 to 660 mm T700 T6E Dry weight, 400 pounds, 180 kilograms, YT700 GE700, 437 pounds, 198 kilograms, T700 GE700, 537 pounds, 244 kilograms, T700, T6E. Topic. Components. Compressor, six stage, five stage axial, one stage centrifugal. Combustors, annular. Turbine, two stage gas generator and two stage power turbine. Fuel type, JP4 or JP5, YT700 GE700. Oil system, self contained, pressurized, recirculating dry sump. Topic. Performance Maximum power output, YT700 GE-700 to 1536 shp 1145 kW, T700 GE-700 to 1622 shp 1210 kW, T700, T6E, 2380 shp 1775 kW, YT706 GE-700 to 2638 shp 1967 kilowatts overall pressure ratio 17x specific fuel consumption 0.433 t700 t6e to 0.465 t700 ge 701a pound per horsepower h Power to weight ratio 3.84 shp per pound 6.31 kilowatts per kilogram YT700 GE700 3.71 shp per pound 6.10 kilowatts per kilogram T700 GE700 4.48 shp per pound 7 37 kilowatts per kilogram T700 T6e Topic See also Advanced Affordable Turbine Engine, a program to develop a T700 replacement.